What's up, people? Welcome to my channel. This is Aki Bar with Flow Deco. As usual, guys, I'm always here to do these videos concerning the construction with our new product, Beam to Beam Flooring. Today, I'm in Matasia. This area is called Merisho, and we are building a foundation from ground up without the need to excavate the cotton soil. As you know, people, this cotton soil here heaves and expand when it has water. So in most cases, we excavate it and backfill the space. And this process is tedious and expensive. So with beam to beam flooring, a product manufactured by Floor Deco, we're going to change the narrative or the way foundations are done without the need to excavate the, so the soil and just leaving it there and just building the new way. So I welcome you in today. Let me take you through here. So this house has been designed by an architect and we have a structural engineer. Kubuka, Nyumba Niyo Migu. So these columns here. So this column here is what is the, is the leg in it. It's, 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 it's what support the building, it's what support all the weight of a building. So definitely it has gone all the way down to the level where there's a, the soil, the rock that support the building. So definitely uh, a geologist or a structural engineer is able to tell where the bearing to support the building is found at. So we dig to that point and then to the token IOG. And when we are off the soil, cotton soil, you can see we just, we just off by just maybe a foot or a foot and a half. We introduce this, it's called a ground beam. And then when you do the ground beam, we are able now to put our products on top. This is the beam to beam flooring, it's going to sit pretty on it. But we have the, the soil under here. So when it heaves, remember the characteristic of cotton soil heaves and expand. When it heaves, it will not reach our foundation. So this is a cost saving here. No, it's no, no excavation of soil. And you have this product. And the space in between here is backfilled by these pots, these hollow blocks. You just backfill. You have an opportunity to run your cables, electricity, uh, piping for plumbing, and it's a quick job. So we've actually done this within a few hours. Right now it's like midday. This has been done. We just need guys lifting off the beams and the block and actually putting them on top of the ring beam that we have to create a suspended foundation so these people are semi-skilled semi-skilled laborers you know Ajamam Kono Kwa site with a supervision of one person so basically doing this kind of a foundation is very cheap in labor and very quick and very easy. It's more like a do-it-yourself concept. So the underside here, it's left like that, bear. Some people are concerned about animals, snakes, or even rodents living underneath. When this is covered, whatever lives in here cannot find its way out, or even way out. So it's safe, and also very strong. So you can see, Already by just interlocking the beam and the block, you already have a surface to work on. So we're going to do a small topping of five centimeter on top to cover the slab. Very easy. So thank you once again for joining my video. I'm always happy. So I'll be back again with a full complete foundation slab, a centennial. 